So this is a project that I supplied plants for many years ago. It's, the, it's called elevated wetlands. So basically they're taking the water out of the Don River, which is a major river that flows through Toronto. And because the water is somewhat polluted, they thought, okay, how can we treat the water with a different system and then return it back to the stream again, to the river. And so they created these structures and they're basically filled up with chunks of recycled tire and that creates a habitat for different microorganisms. And so they have a solar pump and it's pumping that water up from the river and then it goes into the first one and then you can see it's planted with different plants so the plants are providing some oxygen into the root zone and they're sucking up some of the nutrients helping to break down the toxic chemicals and feeding the microbiome that's there so they're secreting enzymes and breaking down the, the toxic chemicals and then it flows from one into the other and then it comes down and then we're into a bit of a, a wetland so it's it's moving across this landscape and eventually as it moves through this marsh the water is being cleaned up and eventually it'll go back into the river again so it's a, a circular system but it's giving a little bit more residence time and allowing the nutrients to be absorbed and allowing the toxic chemicals to be broken down so just thinking about different ways that you can break down the toxic chemicals and using different cycles like this so that you can have cleaner water moving through your cities if you've got a polluted area how are you going to clean it up how are you going to use the microorganisms in the plants to clean up that system